Hello everyone, that manga kid here to do a quick review of Othello by Satomi Ikezawa. This is a Delray release, so this is out of print, um, but this is a seven volume series, um, basically about a girl who is very shy, super gullible, super easy to push around and bully and manipulate. Um, her name's Yaya, and she has like a couple of friends who really just like to push her around and bully her but she is so naive that she doesn't really notice that they're being mean and when she does notice that they're being mean she doesn't say anything or do anything about it um but she has a couple alter egos she loves cosplay and like kind of punk um uh like visual key uh sort of style um, and so she meets up with cosplay buddies and has like a different name that she uses when she's with them. And then it's basically about her and her multiple personality. So there's Yaya and then there's Nana and she turns into Nana, um, unknowingly. Nana is this super confident, violent, um, doesn't take anyone's shit. Like she just, she beats people up and, and serves what she calls justice, um, to people that are mistreating Yaya. So Yaya doesn't know that she turns into Nana. So she just has these blackout moments um, that she doesn't know what happened, what's going on, but then everybody around her is confused because this Nana person um, is, is there. Uh, so slowly but surely, the people in her life kind of figure out that, that Nana and Yaya are the same person, but Yaya doesn't know that Nana exists. Nana does know that Yaya exists because Nana comes out in order to defend Yaya. Um, the art is pretty nice. Um, it's, you know, it's decent. Um, there's Nana there. But I love the, the fashion is pretty cool. Um, like the kind of Lolita gothic style going on there. Um, yeah, the art is kind of like in places it's really good and then in other places the faces look really weird um it's not super consistent which is unfortunate but um a lot of like the chapter pictures are quite nice um yeah like there's a lot of fashion kind of moments as like the spread for the chapters and things like that Anyway, um, the art's pretty decent. It is it is what it is. I like it. Um, the story itself, I found to get annoying. Um, I liked it. I'm glad I own it. I'm glad I got it. But the main guy, like the love interest guy, I like him. Um, he's pretty great. I like his friends, I like his band, I like that so sort of style. Um, there is a musical element to this because she loves singing, but she's too nervous to. So when Nana comes out, Nana sings. And that reminds me of um, Nana, the manga Nana, um, and those kind, that kind of vibe. And that's what I loved. And I thought at the beginning that that was what this was going to be about. And then it just didn't really expand on that too much. Um, it kind of stayed as like an undertone of the story, the musical kind of aspect, but for the most part, it really didn't focus on that. It focused on like Nana serving justice to people who were bullying Yaya. Um, and it turned into just like a story about bullying, but like not, a not an uplifting story about bullying, more like an annoying, like people are just being really, really nasty to her and she doesn't do anything about it. And it just became like, if you're going to sit there and not say anything and continue to hang out with these people who treat you like garbage, I don't really have sympathy for you because you can't even just walk away. You're, you're that nervous and, and naive that you think that they're still good people, even though they're completely treating you like garbage. I don't, I can't sympathize with that. I can't, I can't get my head around that, how someone could stay around people like that and still think, oh, there's good in the, in these people. Um, why are they treating me like this? Why are you being mean to me now? You're usually nice, but they're not usually nice though. They're, they're always terrible. 
and it just got annoying all of the bullies and the different enemies that pop up they're just annoying and her reaction to them was annoying and i just was getting annoyed um the only part of the book i liked or the, the series that i liked was the musical part and the part where nana would come out and 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 sing and be involved with the band that stuff i liked but everything else became really frustrating and irritating um if you find this like i did for super cheap um you'll find it used because it is out of print but if you find it for super cheap the art is good the story's okay certain parts of it are awesome other parts of it suck um it i'm glad i have it i'm gonna keep it i'll probably reread it in the future but it became more annoying than enjoyable to be honest and if if it's not super um on your list of things you want to get then then just pass it honestly um Unless again you find it for really cheap like I did, but if not, don't don't bother. It's not super great, um, but yeah. If you've read this and uh, let me know what you thought of it in the comments. If you have more questions about it, absolutely ask away. Uh, thank you for watching. See ya.